lights, camera, action. The golden age of Hollywood is back with a new TV series about Cary Grant. The drama takes us behind the scenes of a remarkable life in Hollywood. It's a kind of story that Dickens might have thought up. A young lad told that his mother died, distraught, joins the circus, goes to America. He's there on his own in a big city, fights and scraps, becomes an actor, and ultimately becomes Cary Grant, one of the most famous movie stars there's ever been. And then he gets the call from Bristol, where he was born, from his father, who says, your mother's still alive. What a story. It actually happened, which I love. And secondly, it happened about this incredibly famous figure. It's a side of him that was hidden. When they first asked me, I thought, you'd have to be an idiot to try and play Cary Grant. And then I realized they weren't asking me to play him. He was playing him. All of it was an act. Cary Grant was essentially a construct. Inside him was always Archie Leach. What we did is we pull the layers back on this iconic movie star and show you all the demons that haunted him and the ways that he tried to get over that. In our world, which is obsessed with fame, and obsessed with celebrity, don't believe anything you see. Nobody is that. He had as far from the perfect inner life as you can possibly imagine. That's the only reason to tell the story, to see a real human being. I think people will be really surprised to see what went on in his life. The trials and tribulations, there's a lot going on. You definitely get under Cary Grant's skin in a way that we haven't seen before. I think the audience are going to be really surprised and hugely entertained. It's about the things we do to sort of survive and, and, the, and the masks we create and, and how real they become. In the end, it's about a little boy and a traumatic childhood that he's trying to escape. It was many, many things, but he was always seeking peace. You'll have to watch the show and find out if he gets any. Archie is streaming now on BritBox. To learn more, go to BritBox.com.